What's going on people, it's Michael here, otherwise known as Mike Aris Gaming. First of all, I just want to apologise for the last couple of days, no uploads, purely because I've been so busy with stuff and I just haven't had the time to actually render out these videos and upload them before, say, 11 o'clock. So, by the time it gets to like 11 o'clock, it'll be too late to upload, so I just haven't uploaded in the last few days. So, today, we have an upload. And it is episode 7 of 0 to 100. As you can see now, we're just getting Gibson back into the side. He actually ran out of, uh, I was going to say he ran out of fitness, but he actually got injured. So what we did was we discarded him and just got another one. So we basically only pay like 50 coins for him. So that's fine. I'd rather pay that than say 200 coins plus for a contract or healing or fitness. So I'd rather just discard him and uh, just get one cheaper. Also, we did get Rafael from Man United, the right back, the Brazilian, the beast, and we put him straight into the side, take away that bronze guy, boom. Now we have a full gold squad, boys. So it's looking beautiful. As you can see now, we are just going into the first game, and let's see what this guy has got. He has got a three-star rated team, 87 chemistry, and oh, he's only got two golds and the rest of the bronze, so this looks like an easy match. Look, Look at this, how, how are we coming up against a guy with this team in this division? Surely he's got coins by now to upgrade his team, I'm not too sure anyway. But as you can see into the clips now, we have Fernando, plays it, goalkeeper saves it, off to Long and Long puts it in to make it 1-0 in the 16th minute. What a great start that is to this episode anyway. As I was saying, how has this guy got a bad team in this division? Like surely you'd have upgraded it by now but maybe he's just saving up for one player or something which i think is pretty silly i'd at least upgrade the defense because this guy is about to leak some goals my friend as you can see there you have a titch making it 2-0 in the 20th minute what a goal that was boom straight finesse into the right hand side and the goalkeeper couldn't do anything from our own goalkeeper throws it off straight to nasri he's running straight down the wing guys you can't catch him Monreal, look how far he's up, and he plays it across, and he just tucks it into the goal. Left back scoring a goal there in the 32nd minute to make it 3-0, and that that was a tidy goal that was. Nasri playing it off, and he cuts right inside. No one can catch him, and finesses it straight in to make it 3-0. What a goal! And then another clip from us here. Gibson in the midfield plays it to Jovetic. He well, basically rapes the defender. <laughs> puts it into the goal to make it 4-0. I think that's his second of the game already in the 35, uh, 35th minute, sorry. And yeah, it's just easy, boys. It's so easy. From our corner here, Nazri whips it in. Where's Brown? <laughs> Former Man United player, now plays for Sunderland, I do believe. But yeah, he's old. He ain't got that much pace. But you know what I mean? I got him in my starter pack, so I kept him in. And he gets us a goal there, so paid off really keeping him in. You have a titch now, boom, hat trick, hat trick for your boy, Stefan Jovetic in the 60th minute, I don't even know what the score is after that, is it 6-0, I'm not too sure, you have a titch there, getting a hat trick, beautiful boys, into the second half, we have you have a titch. he just <laughs> dummies the guy, he's on the floor, he's going to skill pass some more, plays it over to Long, he finishes it nicely into the bottom right, and that's his second goal of the game as well in the 66th minute, so it's brilliant boys we we only got uh, long as a substitute player as well so it's good to put him into the team and he bangs in a few goals for us so that's great we now have long to Jovetic back to long he's gonna run all the way through he's pacing no one can catch him he's through on goal now he has a shot straight into the back of the net and that's his hat trick as well so two hat tricks in one game it's it's crazy <laughs> this guy had no chance and we just kept banging him in for fun I just wanted to see how many goals I could get in this game, basically. Now we're into the 87th minute. Jovetic here getting his fourth of the game in the 88th minute. And wow, <laughs> it's too easy. It's 9-0 now, I think. So, you know what I mean? We're just smashing this guy. We're just smashing. <laughs> I don't know if we get any upgrades after this game either. I'm not too sure how many coins we have. But as you can see now, Jovetic running on through. Can he get his fifth of the game? Of course he can in the 90th minute to make it 10 nil boys that is our second 10 goal thriller in two episodes so that is just insane boys can we get a like for that Jovetic there getting five goals in one game I'm, I'm not sure if anyone's even done that in real life I think I think the record is five actually so 
The other tits just got it there. Obviously, this is FIFA, not real life, but who cares? It's amazing. The other tits getting five. As I said, Long getting three. Monreal getting one. I think that's actually it. No, Wes Brown got one as well, yeah. So, there we go. Ten goals in that game. It's just crazy, boy. We love it. We love it. It's just beautiful. Anyway, there you go. We get the three points. and um, We only need three more points to move into the next division. What do we do now? We actually get Yanazai to put in that left mid spot. He's a crazy player. He's got some decent pace, some skills, and he's very young. And obviously, I support Man United, so I'm going to get Yanazai in the team. Pace, left footed, he's, he's a great player. And we need him to replace that bronze guy that we had playing in left mid, who was a left wing back anyway, and bronze. So, yeah, we got Yanazai for that. As you can see, now we're going into the next game. He has a four and a half star team. He's got Sturridge, Remy, Sissoko, Eto for some reason at left mid, John Terry for some reason, and he's got Joe Hart. By the way, Joe Hart is crazy. Basically, we had about 30 shots in this game, and he saved pretty much all of them. Apart from the goals that you're about to see now, Lukaku running off through, and boom, straight past the goal. He shouldn't have brought him out because we can just finesse it around him, and there we go, boys. 39 minutes it took to get the first goal of this game. As I said, we had bare shots in this game. We was all over him anyway, so didn't really matter. We finished it there nicely with Lukaku. Forster now from the goal kick. Plays it to Lucas Leiva. Is he going to pass it off yet to Gibson? To Lukaku, back to Lucas. Straight through to Long. He's going to pace it. He's going to go down the wing. Does he cut inside? Yes, of course he does. He's still got it. He's going through. He's going to get past everyone. He bangs it. Oh, shit. Shane Long, the three-star skilling Irish beast, makes it 2-0. And after that, I think this guy had enough of my shots. So guess what he went and done? Pause the game. Do, 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 do. Hmm. Let me think. Yep, of course. Rage quit. This guy rage quit. He couldn't handle the shots. The boys. Anyway. 3,500 coins there. We did indeed win the title of that division. So that puts us into the next division. And I'm not too sure what that is. Until it comes up. I don't know. Meh. I think it's uh, division 8. Maybe 7. But I'm not too sure. Current division 8. Yeah. We're in division 8 now boys. Anyway if you did enjoy the video please leave a like. And hit that subscribe button if you want to keep up to date with all my future content. Anyway, guys, I'll see you around. Peace.